All right, Commodore 64 here, we're back. We're gonna take a look at Romper Rooms, I Love My Alphabet. I'm assuming this is based on the TV show because it's straight up taking the name Romper Room, which, okay, Romper Room, I Love My Alphabet. First Star Software, so the same people that made uh, Flip Flop. All right. So there's the head of a caterpillar. Wow, it's going off. All right. Pretty good animation. It's pretty fluid. The dude rotates. And, wow, man. Okay. Watch the letter, press a letter, find the letter. You know what? Let's watch the letters. Or do I have to do it with a joystick? Okay, so you hit the button and then Matt Swiggles is in 10A most of the time. And you push right on the one you want to do. Okay. So. Great, but how do I get to another letter? you get to another letter. Maybe you gotta hit B. Hmm, alright, well, we'll skip that option, I guess, because I don't know how to do the next part, which seems... Press a letter, okay? Max blinks his eyes just for fun. Max closes. I'm gonna assume that's his eyes when he is ready for bed. I don't know what the hell happened there. D. Max likes to dance almost any time. I don't know of Max, but it's also been. Jeez. Probably close to 30 years since I saw an episode of Romper Room. Max is a big round Easter egg. That's what he is, huh? Okay, F. Max was fast when he said, wow, Max is hauling ass, look at that. I gotta say, the animation's pretty good for, like, a throwaway kid's title. Let some grow to make him tall. Make him so tall. Okay. Hops and hops and has lots of fun. I just remember Romper Room had the magic mirror at the end where the lady would... I, I guess it was a different lady in every major city, but in... This area, it was uh, Socorro, Socorro, and it was basically like a, a wire hanger that she formed into the shape of a a mirror, and she would say, I see, and then the names of like about 5,000 kids, and you would never hear your own name, but you would always like hope that she said, wow, Max kicks a ball. Okay. Look up and down and all around. Spin in a circle. Oh, nope. Alright. Oh, no, he's mad. They stole that shit from Mario World. Okay, um... Shakes his head when he's telling you no. I have an oscillating fan at home. It looks like the fan is saying no. Max opens his mouth and then he closes it. Okay. Oh no. Wow. Max is watching you masturbate. Okay. Uh. Get back out here, you dick. I got stuff to do. Thank you. Max is quiet only when he sleeps. Alright.
but still pretty fast. You're pretty fast, Max. Wow. Yeah, that's very green. Taps his feet to stay with the beat. Uh, 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 alright. We'll float up like an orange balloon. Okay. I got happy when he came down. All right, V. Okay. What's after V? Here is TVW. Man, Max goes for a walk, but he'll be right back. I don't remember Max on Romper. I'm gonna have to Google that in a minute here to see what the actual thing looks like. So I don't remember this ball thing at all. Max has no bones. Okay. Um, it looks like a ghost when he's white. Uh huh. He's telling you yes. That's his hat, but he always comes back. Oh, geez. Alright. Oh, whoops. Find the letter. Alright. That's right. Okay. So this would have been okay if you were, you know, a little kid learning how to use a computer, I guess. How to use a keyboard and how to spell. And the winter Max likes to skate on the ice. They're pretty ballsy to skate with no shoe or no uh, skates, just barefooted. Alright, so it seems like the same things as push the letter. No, get out of here. I don't want to find the letter. No. Alright. Oh shit. No. Letter quiz. Match what Max does. Alright, so that's probably H. Alright, let's see if I can pass this. I wasn't fully paying attention because I'm trying to remember Romper Room. Okay. Next. B. His voice sounds like a bird. Sounds like R2D2 or something. Alright, I only do one more and then I gotta look up Romper Room on the. No, I don't. I have no idea. R. No, I wasn't right, I'll do it again. Okay, watch what Max does. Oh, it's antennae. That's A. Okay, so let me Google this real quick. Romper Room Max. See, it doesn't even come back with anything. Mac Dre. Mac Dre, later Jay Diggs, and a member of the Romper Room crew. No, that's not it. Romperroom.com. Cocktail Lounge on Maiden Lane in Union Square, San Francisco. No. Romper Room. TV show, how about? Ah, here we go. Long running series that ran in the United States from 53 to 94, as well as internationally in Canada, UK, New Zealand, Australia, Japan, and Finland. Oh, I want to see some Japanese romper room. I bet that shit's crazy. Hostesses, wow, there's a whole list of hostesses. Holy crap. Alright, let me control F here, Max. The hostess, Miss Iris Maxwell. Okay, well, that's not. Okay, so that must just be a character they made up for the TV show. Let's see. Los Angeles Romper Room aired on KCOP TV. That's right, Channel 13. There were only two hosts, Miss Mary Ann and Mrs. Soko. Socorro Serrano hosted from 1977 until it ended and was the first Latina of Mexican American heritage to host Romper Room.
Wow, it ended in 1989. Well, how the hell did I watch it after that? Maybe it was, uh, maybe it was uh, reruns. Controversial. Okay, well, hang on here. Two controversial events were connected with Romper Room. The hostess of the Phoenix franchise of Romper Room linked her own name with that of the ongoing controversies over abortion. She sought hospital approval for abortion on the ground that she had been talking taking thalidomide and believed her child would be born deformed. She made a public announcement about the dangers of thalido thalid thalidomide. I don't even know. And the hospital refused to allow an abortion. Apparently because of her announcement and its own fear of publicity. She traveled to Sweden for the abortion. Upon completion, it was confirmed that the fetus had no legs and only one arm. Wow. Okay. Uh, after the Children's Television Watchdog Group Action for Children's Television was organized in 1968, the group's first target was Boston's version of Romper Room, which at that time was a children's show that focused on the promotion of its branded line of toys to its viewers. Oh, wow. Okay. They scaled back the whole host role in pitching the product, program's products. In the 80s, Hasbro sold Romper Room branded toys and products. Wow, I don't remember that. But yeah, nothing in here about old, uh, old Max. But that's Romper Room's I Love My Alphabet. A pretty basic thing, but if you were uh, like a little kid and you were down with Romper Room, you know, I guess this is okay. It's not horrible. You're going to learn the alphabet, which is, you know, what it's here for. But, uh,. Yeah, Socorro Serrano. Oh, you know what? I want to see a picture of that lady now. Socorro Serrano. Romper Room. Oh, yeah, I totally remember that lady. She looks kind of like, uh,. If Ralph Macchio was a girl, kind of, Ralph Macchio always looked kind of femme anyway, but this picture of the first one here looks like Karate Kid holding a B. But uh, anyway, that's it for now, so I'll be back with something else that hopefully requires less uh, Wikipedia reading, and I'll see you in another one. Thanks for watching.